Hey y'all, tap in with your girl one time, Grand Rising. I know damn well I shouldn't have said something about them copyrighting my damn video because that's exactly what they did. I'm not sure, you know, what's that mean exactly, but whatever, as long as people can still see it, like it, and comment. Okay, I said I don't own copyrights to the shit. Why would you still copyright my shit? It can make sense. Are, are you just showing that you monitoring my channel like that? You feel me? I don't give a damn. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> okay, let's go. <laughs> oh, this stupid ass shit. I was listening to a reading here. Intuitive Goddess 333. Shout out to Bella, man. 44 on the clock. She tapped in for show. She one of my fave uh, tarot readers, too. Because I do listen to tarot. I do listen to other readers. I don't listen to everybody because I can't vibe with everybody. Maybe it's somebody's voice or something that they do or say that I just don't like. You feel me? No offense. You know what I'm saying? It's just not for me. And I turn that shit off. And I don't know. I really don't like male tarot readers. But it's one that I do like. Let me shout him out right quick. He be like, I'm too tapped in. <laughs> yes, you are tapped in, my guy. Um, I just recently subscribed to his channel and started watching him. But he definitely be picking up on me for sure. What is his name? Hold on one second. And he is he is fine too. Hello. Grand Rising. <laughs> Alright, um, what is his damn name? Let me go. Okay, Divinely Guided Chosen, Star C. That's his name. Shout out to him. Okay, of course, I got to shout out Maji got the T. I fucks with her. I fucks with the Peppermint Tarot LLC. I fucks with La Rasha for sure. I think La Rasha might have been one of the first ones that I was watching that really helped me wake the fuck up. Like, no bullshit. Um, um, I do like uh, Empress Lillian as well. Okay, I like Miss Pat too, Okay. Um, I'm probably forgetting somebody here, but I just fuck with people, like, you know what I'm saying? I mean, if you got it, you got it. Not everybody got that shit, you feel me? And they be putting on. So, that's why I say that. That's just a fact. But I would like to listen to some music here in the background a little bit. Like, that should be... You should be allowed to do some shit like that. Like, this shit's stupid as fuck. How they be trying to really control everything that you fucking do. Like, goddamn. Y'all even got to control what the fuck I post on the goddamn internet. I can't post what I want to post with me listening to a video or vibing or shit. Like, come on, man. That shit corny. This shit corny. Like, you know what I'm saying? I don't want to be on this uh realm and this dimension. I don't want to be on this shit no more. I'm ready to move on is, is this a game or something like what's the next level like you know what i'm saying uh, have i not reached the next level yet like we're going we're going you feel me let's tap in man because i feel like somebody is getting ready to motherfucking move up maybe you get ready to move somebody out the way okay without moving somebody out the way you know what i'm saying shit I just feel like people need to really just go about doing shit differently. You know what I'm saying? Try to do some different shit. Okay? Yeah. Why why y'all can't just, you know, stop trying to be in control of everything? Like that shit, wow. Y'all even be so so uh obsessed with being in control that y'all be trying to motherfucking um I done lost my damn train of thoughts, you know what I'm saying? You want me to shut the fuck up and you trying to control my motherfucking, you know what I mean, my thoughts and shit. They hate when they can't control your mind, you feel me? That's when shit get real. Oh, oh my gosh, who is that? Oh, this person has woke up. Oh no, what are we going to do about that? Oh, we're just going to fucking get in the group and we're going to bully up on them. We're going to fucking do our little magic, whatever, bullshit witchcraft fucking bullshit goddamn spell work bullshit you know what i'm saying everything that god said not to do we gonna do that you feel me like no wonder why they took god out of everything okay 
If they hadn't did that, man, the world would be different. The world would be a better place. If they haven't, if they hadn't taken away, because like Shorty said on the reading the other day, the celebrities definitely, this could have even been yesterday, the celebrities definitely um, <clears throat> are of authority. You know what I'm saying? People look up to y'all. Like, why are y'all, you know what I mean, down in this shit too? Like, y'all play a major part in what's going on too in the world. Y'all got to do better as leaders. You feel me? Or get your ass up out the way. Because it's a whole heap of, heap of real fucking artists over here. You feel me? That's hungry. Okay? They want to eat. You feel me? Motherfuckers is deciding who, who get and who don't. Like, that's not right. When God said it's enough for everybody. Okay? They just took over and just, you know, erased. They came over, erased history. You know what I'm saying? Erased, you know, how shit was supposed to go and rewrote that shit how they wanted it to go. And just for, and just whatever, how it ever was supposed to go, that shit just got lost and just never came back to. Fuck that. Fuck that. Every hurricane comes to an end. Okay, that storm is motherfucking over. Period. Type down below, the storm is over now. Okay, baby, the storm is over now. God said, don't be afraid to sing, baby. Your spaceship is here to take you on where you're trying to get to, baby. Where they try to stop you from getting to, baby. Look at that. On your throne. They're trying to stop you from getting on your throne. God is saying, no, you is, your potential is endless here. You finna show them, baby. Okay? Period here. Definitely, we got a witch involved, Okay? This witch try to stop your justice from coming in, baby. But you about to get that shit. You about to get that shit. Singing can be significant, okay? That might be how you get your justice. Or you might need to just talk. Use your throat chakra. Okay, definitely. This storm is over here. Okay, we got a storm here. These motherfuckers was trying to goddamn keep this storm from ending. Okay, with the skies here. They wanted to keep your skies gray. Okay, but endings are inevitable. Endings are inevitable. Oh, oh. <laughs> okay, definitely look at this control shit. I just need to, let me just, Lord. I thought God was in control. How y'all, how y'all trying to, what y'all trying to play, God? Y'all trying to play with people? You know what I'm saying? Make people like a little muppet or a puppet. You know what I'm saying? Torturing people. Shit ain't right, man. Look at the book. Look at the book. It's like, yeah, y'all follow this shit, okay? This, this shit, this shit that I can control you with. Y'all follow this. They don't even follow their own motherfucking shit. They own laws and rules and shit that they created. They don't even follow. Okay, we got 22 here. Twin flame can be uh, significant. We also got 44 here. The 27th of a month can be significant. The 22nd of a month can be significant. Okay, 9 is here and 8 is here. I feel like something is in alignment here, okay? Yeah, do it for you, baby. Okay? God said, do it for you. If not for anybody else, baby, do it for you, okay? Be honest with yourself, okay? Do it for you. And I'm also getting that somebody want to be honest with you. Yeah, you definitely getting ready to celebrate here. You on this throne by yourself, though. You're about to... Uh, be able to celebrate yourself or definitely people could be about to celebrate you. The 29th could be significant. Today is the 29th. Okay. So definitely, um, let me just back it up here. Grand rising. Okay. Practice self love here. Somebody could have definitely been doing some type of potion on you. Okay. Try to come up with some type of potion or something. Okay. This evil queen here. Okay. Um, Yes, Grand Rising, 
Thank you all for being here. Like the video at this time as you enter my kingdom. I really do appreciate that, you know, free love, okay? <laughs> that energetic love, okay? Um, as well as um, thank you, Lord, for waking me up today. Thank you for another opportunity to become greater than great. And I'm definitely feeling an opportunity here. I'm hearing opportunities, plural, with an S on the end, okay? Okay, I'm, I'm feeling like you just got that S on your chest right now. You feel me? Look how, look how this person, look, they want you to fall here. Look how this person is sitting here confidently. Okay? Shit, it's okay. Feel yourself, baby. Your storm is over, baby. You went through the uh, dark night of the soul. You went through the storm, baby. That shit is over with. Something lovely is growing from that. Okay, we're guarding here. Okay, somebody needed that, I'm sure. You know, um, create a garden here. Or, you know, things take time just like a garden does when it comes to, you know, manifesting and bringing things into your life and growth. Okay? Period. I'm feeling like you got the sword. Okay? You're about to receive some type of sword or something. These motherfucker want to be. These motherfucker funny, buddy. These motherfucker think this shit funny, buddy. These motherfucker think this shit funny here. Even the library here. They even got bullshit at the library, so you can't even. Where do you go get real information at? They even got the bullshit in the libraries too. Where can you get real information from? They brainwashing you like hell. They only want you to, you know what I mean? As long as they can control your mind, they can control you. They who. The government, you know who? Them control freaks, okay? It's time for healing, not a war though, you know what I'm saying? We've been at war all of our motherfucking life, okay? All of our life has been a war, okay? Definitely, I'm talking to someone who's confident here. My, my ear is ringing over here, as I said. All my life has been a war, okay? 12, 12 on the clock, you know what I mean? Y'all change this up. Let me see, I was born in 88. So I, I I believe that this change, when they actually did some type of rewrite or you know what I'm saying, started this total Taylor, okay, total Taylorianism, totalitarianism or something like that. They started that in 1984. Okay. So confidence comes with practice and time here. So definitely keep working. Keep going is what I'm hearing. Keep working at it. Okay, keep going. And look, there we go with that sword again on her back. Okay. So fruit could be involved here. Somebody definitely is being guided to uh, eat more fruits. Maybe even go, up, go on like a fruit diet. Or like a fruit fast. Okay, that's gonna, you know what I mean, do some type of shift to have a type of um, impact on you in a in a good way. Mm, you talking to somebody whose potential is endless here. Somebody somebody see you though. Somebody see you though for sure, for sure. Okay, we got thrones here, thorns here, okay. Weave together the crowd you deserve. And I feel like you you did that. You 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 took control of your own life. Okay? You decided to take control of your own narrative and stop letting these motherfuckers control how your shit's supposed to go. And you took control. Okay? And weave together the the crown that you want. Okay? Um, what's that? Period. You could be showing others how to do that as well here. Flowers are significant. I feel like flowers are significant here. So we got, um, what is this? Bitch fire in reverse here. Stand up for yourself. So maybe uh, somebody didn't think that you were going to stand up for yourself and they tried you or they are going to try you because maybe you didn't stand up for yourself before in a certain situation and they thinking that, you know, you still this little uh, whatever. Um, and plus magic could have played a part in whatever happened. You feel me? With witches here, okay? Bitch fire, okay? This could be a fire sign or something. You might have to stand up to a fire sign. Don't gotta be. I don't give a damn what sign they is. You're gonna have to stand up to somebody here. 
Okay, but stand up for yourself. I don't give a damn who you are. You need to stand up for yourself, shit. Period. Our ancestors ain't do all that fighting and, you know what I'm saying, sacrificing and marching and all that for you not to be out here standing up for yourself. Come on, man. Please, these people weak. Whoever got to do this, control you and use magic and use whatever they use it to control you, manipulation to control you, they weak. They're weak as hell. 1515 was on the clock here. Somebody need to look up that number, 1515 here. Definitely, we got to take a chance on them and make a change, okay? I feel like somebody want to take a chance on you in a certain situation and make a change here. Or somebody didn't think that you was going to make the change here and stand up for yourself. And that's why they took a chance here. I'm hearing wrong move, okay? You got fairies there protecting you. Okay, you could also have like fairy blood or something like that. There we go with the sword here, though. The word sword is there, so a sword is significant. Okay, but somebody with the sword or, you know, somebody that's up there need to make the change and quit playing. We got the number seven here, so maybe in July, maybe in July we'll see some type of uh, change here. The number seven is there, okay? Uh, so we got, don't doubt yourself, don't doubt your worth, you are always enough here with endings, okay? Endings are inevitable, okay? So definitely, <laughs> it says don't doubt your worth, endings are inevitable, okay? If somebody doesn't think that they're going to be, you know what I'm saying, worthy or worth anything if if this change happens or takes place god said it's enough for everybody okay but i don't know you know if you've been abusing your authority and stuff like that it's over for you look at how this boat is like up on the clouds here you 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 demons you you demonic people you satanic worshipers satan worshipers devil worshipers y'all really don't believe in god that's crazy to me but y'all believe in the devil y'all believe in evil but you don't believe in god okay anything else father god they gonna learn today okay look they gonna learn today under my umbrella okay Ella, Ella, eh, 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 eh. Under my umbrella, Ella, Ella, eh, 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 eh. So Rihanna could be significant here. She could want to take you out or something, or, you know, she could want to get to know you here. She sees your potential. Okay. Um, somebody is being guided to start a revolution here. Okay. We need a resolution. We need a resolution. Baby, won't you know? Baby, what you know? Shout out to Aaliyah. Okay. We need a revolution. We need a revolution. Uh, mm, mm. Okay, it's time for a healing, not war, though. Okay. Period. Treat your body like the palace that it is, baby. Love yourself. Show yourself more love here. Okay? Beautiful energy. Okay, we got um, music notes here. So, I think I'm going to use my music deck here. Because I'm definitely... Um, let's see. I don't know. These people could be significant to something here. Or definitely, maybe... Maybe one of these uh, celebrities could be the one to start the, you know what I mean, the protest. Like, you know what I'm saying? Because y'all hold a lot of authority. Y'all got a lot of money. Y'all got a lot of people that already look up to you and listen to you and follow you and all this extra shit, okay? Period. Somebody's name could be Yo-Yo or Yolanda. You know what I'm saying? 
Let's go. Somebody like your style. Somebody like the way you do things. Yeah, somebody like your hustle. Okay? Somebody want to give you some cash. <laughs> yeah, because they like your style. Okay, period. We got Nikki D here. That's order here. Okay, something is in. Something is like divine timing here. Something is order. <laughs> oh, Lord, have mercy. Lord, have no mercy. Have no mercy on these evil people. Okay, what else do we need to know here? Or who else is involved here? What information can we get from this deck today? Okay, we got self-esteem here. It was definitely trying to attack your self-esteem here, okay? Period. Whoa. Whoa, that shit almost hit the flow. So definitely, I feel like somebody didn't want you to, you know, rise, okay? They wanted you to stay close to the ground, okay? And it says resistance and power like don't resist the power don't resist that change 21 21 on the clock don't resist the power of god you will not be able to resist the power of god okay sister soldier look sister soldier is getting ready to you know what i mean have some type of uh i don't know paparazzi or press or you know getting some type of interviews or some shit like that Whoa, whoever this sister, sister soldier person is here. We got too many messages here. We got Lil' Kim showing up here. That was just too many, baby. Okay, we got scissor energy here with passion. Okay, somebody um feel like you're very passionate about your work or whatever it is that you do here. Yep, they also say or feel like you're versatile and they like that about you. Okay, we got versatility here. I'm talking to somebody that can do it all, okay? Somebody that's very gifted, very talented. Somebody that can do multiple things or has multiple gifts here, okay? Somebody name could be Jean, okay? Somebody name could be Gray or Gray could be significant. The color Gray could be significant. As you see, I for sure got me a Gray streak. That's natural though. You know what I'm saying? So, um, I don't know, I've never seen this on her neck, but somebody could have something on her neck or a tattoo, a neck tattoo, or um, maybe somebody tried to brand you or something with some type of tattoo, or maybe that's something, maybe that's some type of brand that they do in the music industry with tattoos, okay, that could be significant. Okay. Anything else? Better yet, anybody else, okay? Wow, I've been picking up on Nikki energy all day here. Nikki Minaj here, okay? We got leadership. That's what I'm saying. Y'all the leaders. You know what I mean? Y'all need to start acting like one, okay? Nikki Minaj energy here. Who else? Who else here? All right, we got three. I'm not going to take these. We got guidance here with you as girls. I'm hearing like us girls. Like we got to we gotta stand up. Us girls. Okay? Women, we need to stick together. Okay? These men definitely don't think that we should be in any position of power. Okay? Still, even after all these years, when, when women didn't have no rights, Okay, women had to fight for their rights. We still fighting for our rights. Okay. I don't see um what would be the harm in allowing a woman to take over. Y'all men trying to run the world and control the world and do what y'all do and it's not working here. Okay, this shit is gonna self destruct if, if we don't change and go about shit differently and do some other things here. Us girls, us women, I feel like we got to do something, okay? So here we got Nicki Minaj, all these all these women here that's 
in a position of power, okay, of authority in leadership positions, okay, Lizzo, okay, shit, self-love here, shit, big girls need love too, I know a lot of uh, masculines and feminines that like big girls, okay, they say that, you know what they say about them big girls, big girl got that wet, okay, definitely with instinct here, it's like somebody want to do something, they want to make the change. They want to go against the grain here. But it's like, damn, I'm here and they could lose everything or, you know what I'm saying? They just really in their head about this shit. Okay. So magic could have been done too by any of these people or any of these people could know about some magic shit. Okay. She looked like her head hurt. You feel me? So that's a... uh. You know, a sign that somebody is doing some type of magic on you. Look, like like they trying to control your mind with instinct, okay? Always, always follow your first instinct. That is definitely God. That is definitely your guidance. Oh, my God. That card flew over there and knocked my pen over. Who is this? We got salt and pepper here with sexuality. Okay, definitely... They definitely trying to control somebody's sexuality here as well. Okay? They definitely trying to make people gay. They trying to control sexuality here to keep this devil energy, to keep this evil energy. Okay? I grew up listening to Salt and Pepper, okay? Shout out. This is a deck full of nothing but women of authority. Okay, let's go. Period here. Okay, use your voice here with Angie Martinez. Okay, something about your voice. Okay, these people like your voice. Maybe just the sound of it, whether you sing or not. Maybe just you talking. Okay, New York is significant here. Okay, and we also got love here so somebody loves your voice here that just came out together here we got beyonce here so somebody loves your voice here okay we all know that they saying she the queen of the witches okay she the queen of the witches okay mm -hmm. here we go with megan the stallion at the bottom of the deck here they, they just starting to say that she sold her soul to the devil or so uh, sacrifice somebody. Was it her mom? I can't remember here. We got defense here. Definitely. You got to put your guard up. Defend yourself. Stand up for yourself here with defense. This person got their boxing gloves on. Okay. Somebody could be a boxer. Okay. A boxer involved in something. A boxer could have been involved in doing some type of magic or something. This person could be a punk and really can't even fight. Roxanne, Roxanne, I want to be your man. Okay, so somebody want to be your man here, and you might have to defend yourself against somebody. Okay, that person definitely could be in devil energy. Definitely, we got Missy Elliott at the bottom of the deck here. She don't even look like the same Missy Elliott. I don't know who this person is. The Missy Elliott that they showing around today is like a clone. They don't look nothing like Missy. I don't give a damn what y'all say. Oh, she looks so good. And oh, she just, no, that's not no motherfucking Missy Elliott. Fuck out of here. That's not no Missy Elliott, okay? That's another thing they try to confuse her. Just like a dude was telling me that they seen a guy at the store that looked just like Tupac. The only thing they was missing was the damn nose ring, okay? So they keep trying to say that Tupac is alive. You know what I mean? I feel like. Matter of fact, let me just ask my pendulum right now. I don't feel like Tupac is alive, but even if, let's say Tupac is actually dead, they could be trying to bring back a lookalike, you know what I'm saying, to confuse people, you know what I'm saying, to get people to follow them, him, okay? That's what I feel like they're going to be trying to do here. Definitely, Missy Elliott, I feel like, is a clone here. Lil' Kim definitely could be some type of clone or something, too. You know what I'm saying? All that damn plastic surgery and shit people got going on. Y'all need to do all that. Love yourself, man. She was fine. She was perfect. She was perfect before she did all that. 
You know what I mean? Trying to, she she let them people control, but that could, they could have been, you know what I mean? Magic could have been used there too, or manipulation. You know, they they made them feel like they had to look a certain way. You know what I'm saying? Or they just wanted them to look a certain way so that they could, you know, portray it to the world in a sense to control them. Okay. I mean, people dying now from getting surgeries and motherfucking uh, adjustments done and shit like that. Clear the energy here. Thank you, Father God. Thank you for the messages. Okay, so we're trying to figure out uh, what was the question here. I forgot the damn question now. I don't forgot the damn question. What was I about to say? We even got Erica Badu at the bottom of the deck with spirituality here. She confusing shit. Okay. She definitely, I feel like, is doing some type of magic and shit like that. What was I getting ready to ask here? I forgot. Damn. Okay, yeah. Okay, see what I'm saying? See what I'm saying? Shit crazy, man. They think that shit funny, though. There are different type of spiritualities, okay? And not all spirituality is evil, and that's a fact, okay? We got Foxy Brown here with your attitude, okay? Something about your attitude. You got a lot of attitude, okay? Look at this. Um, the color red could be significant here with all this red stuff around her neck. What is that? A fuck? Oh, shit. That's the fuck. Oh, shit. I didn't realize that. Okay. Okay, okay. We got Saweetie here as well here. Okay. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. I forgot what the hell I was about to damn say. See what I'm saying? They, I feel like they tried to even be so much in control that they tried to erase people's memories so they, they, they wouldn't out for remember things. Okay? Or so like, you know, when they woke up from the magic or whatever that was done, okay, they would just, you know, be like, Okay, so this is what's going on now? Cool, like, you know, and just go with it. Yeah, we got angels here. Definitely, Aaliyah was an angel, okay? Definitely, if Aaliyah was here, she would probably definitely be leading the singers, okay? I don't feel like, I don't feel like this B would be uh, as big. I ain't gonna say she ain't gonna be as big as she was, but I feel like she would be, you know what I'm saying? She was an angel that was taken, they took her from us in a, in a plane crash. They orchestrated that, okay, because of her knowledge. Knowledge is power. They don't want you to gain your knowledge here. They don't want you to remember who you are. They don't want you to know how powerful you are, okay? Rest in peace, baby girl here. Tommy Hilfiger, I feel like got something to do with this too, okay? Even like clothing lines too. They into that shit as well here. They showed us that with um Saweetie did come out here. They showed us that with uh Target. Okay, how they support Satan and shit like that. Okay. So we got uh innovation and potential that came out here. Saweetie came out with style here. So something about your style here definitely. Missy Elliott definitely has style, but this person is is a an impersonator, I feel like for sure. Okay, and we got young M.A. Young M.A., something happened to her, too. Okay, she just got sick or something. Whatever happened with her, I don't know. But she had something to do with this, or she probably was participating in whatever this shit is. Okay, motherfuckers just randomly getting sick and fucked up. You know what I'm saying? The, the government could be orchestrating that shit, man, for real. Killing people because they can't control them. That's why they, that's why they wanted to kill uh jesus and and god because they couldn't control them okay we got order here i'm here in divine timing okay something big is getting ready to happen okay what else we got here okay definitely self-esteem here we definitely need to love ourselves more here 
Okay, we need to lift each other up. We got Rihanna was here. Okay, we got Rihanna here. Okay, we got Lady Luck here. Once we start lifting each other up and stop hating on each other, you know what I'm saying? We don't got to be in competition with, with each other. We all beautiful. We all strong. We all have a voice. We all got style. We all got attitude. We all powerful. Okay? We got Lady Luck here. Somebody Luck is getting ready to change. Something big getting ready to happen. I feel like you're getting ready to dominate something here. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, with skill here, you getting ready to dominate something here. You could be about to dominate the industry with your skills here. Okay? Somebody could want to put you on, and they like, I just want 10% here. Okay? We got a lot of people that's about to be in their emotions here because, <laughs> yeah, because you're the truth. Okay? Because of your vision. You hold the vision. Okay? You hold the vision here. Okay. That was just too many, Lord. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Still, that's too many, Lord. So some people can look at you like, like you're mysterious here. Okay, because of your spirituality. Because of spirituality, you are mysterious here. Okay. They love your mood here. Your mood is very like chill, very peaceful here. You're very confident. Okay, confidence is key here. Okay, we got gangsta boo here, so you could be some type of gangster or looked at as a gangster or something. Okay, shit. If you live the type of life that we live, man, you gotta you gotta have a little bit of toughness and put up a little bit of boundaries. Okay. Shit. Yeah, here we go with peace here. We got peace here with Monet Love. So she just looks suspect here. This person looks suspect as hell here. So definitely somebody is uh, hiding something or they, they're they not telling you their intentions. Their intentions are not pure here. Okay? When it comes to an offer. Okay? Person could be hating on the low because you are skillful and you are strong as hell here. We got Maya X. Okay, something about Maya and the ex. Okay, Maya could be getting exed out or something like that. We got ambition here. You're ambitious here. Something to do with Dreezy. We got Dreezy here with ambition. Okay. And anything else or anybody else here? Who are, who are we talking about here? All right, we got, uh, yeah, they, this person could be trying to finesse you here. Okay, we got cash doll. Definitely cash, okay? Cash. They wanna they wanna gift you cash here. We got the brat here. You could be rebellious in a way. Okay, with that um we got superstition and pride here. Okay. Yeah. Spirituality at the bottom of the deck. Superstitious and pride. Kalani and Megan Thee Stallion. So we got horses here. Or animals could be involved. Okay. These people could have been sacrificing animals as well. Okay. Don't let pride get in your way as well. Okay. And with superstition, with stoop, superstition here, what goes around comes around. So I'm going to say about that, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, respect. Respect, man. R-E-S-P-E-C-T. You got to give respect in order to get that shit, though, baby. We got Queen Latifah here. Okay, and that's the truth. With Rhapsody at the bottom of the deck. We got Rihanna here with Dominance here. Definitely, we, we need to dominate, take over here, okay? Take over. Take over. Tierra, I feel like you're about to take over here, okay? They said you was whack. <laughs> Tierra whack. They thought that shit was funny. They said you was whack. 
okay? But you are getting ready to, goddamn, you a big dog. You a big dog. Mm -hmm. You a big dog. Yeah. You're inspirational here. You a big dog here. You're inspirational here with Lauren Hill. I'm, I'm also getting that Lauren Hill was your inspiration growing up. Definitely. That's who I was singing to and, you know what I mean, singing like her. That was, that was my hustle. Okay, that was my hustle. Lauren Hill. Okay. Yeah, you were, you were courageous or you showed a lot of courage in a certain situation here. And that is what got you about to, you know what I mean, be on top here. All right, we got Remy Ma here as well. Cut the deck here. We got transition. You getting ready to transition here. You are getting ready to transition here with Spinderella. Okay, something is getting ready to Spinderella. Okay, and that's order. Order. That's order. That's order. We got connectivity here. Somebody want to connect with you. Okay. Look at that plug energy here. So you the plug. Somebody looking at you like you the plug. So whenever these folks come at you with this, uh, you know, offer, because they want to connect with you, just remember that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, these are celebrities, but you a celebrity too, baby. Okay? And you the one that they want here. We definitely got spirituality here and dominance. I feel like spirituality is getting ready to take over the right kind of spirituality. You know, God's spirituality, okay? 4141 on the clock. Let's go. They want to connect with you, baby, because you're confident. Confidence is key here. I don't know what I was getting ready to ask my necklace here. When I took it off, I don't even know. I don't remember. I just feel like that's confirmation on motherfuckers trying to damn erase your memory. Motherfuckers trying to control you. Show me no, Father God. I don't move my hand at all. Show me no. Look how it's moving. Change. It's going in a new direction. Shit is shifting in a new direction, man. Period. Okay. Till next time, guys. Thank you again for tuning in to Tierra Stealing Words Tarot. If you haven't already, as you entered into my kingdom, will you like the video? Subscribe to my channel if you will. I'm just getting up and stuff. Grand Rising again, guys. It's about 10 a.m. here on this Thursday morning. I'm getting ready. I think I, I think we'll go swimming or something. Go do something um with the kids today. I don't think it's gonna be too hot, but it's supposed to be like in the in the hundred degrees um this weekend. It's gonna be baking. Lord. Okay, so some people could actually be frying literally. Somebody could somebody could be about to fry in this sun, literally, especially these witches and I'm hearing warlocks and, you know, evil motherfuckers. They could be about to fry in the sun. That could be why it's about to be so hot. Maybe that's something they can't take or something like that. I don't know. I'm not one of them. Okay. Um Just a message for somebody though, you know. Keep fighting though. Keep fighting. Keep fighting. Anything worth having is going to be worth the fight. Nothing worth having is going to be easy, man, at all. I don't give a damn what it's pertaining to. Just keep that in mind, okay? Um, you're definitely making a change, even if you can't see it. Okay, definitely we got to show ourselves more love. That will stop us, you know, from allowing people to just treat us any old kind of way if we loved ourselves. Okay, how much do y'all love y'all self if y'all if y'all really going and doing all that fake ass surgery and you know what I'm saying getting them booties implanted and titties implanted and you know I want to have that snatch I want to have that you know what I mean y'all portraying fakeness that's all y'all portraying for real for real at the end of the day at the end of the day all y'all doing is is uh portraying fake when y'all gonna start being real celebrities when y'all gonna start being real with yourself. When y'all gonna start being real? But I'll holler.